Hey guys, welcome back. The next test I want to do on my excursion is to check the uh, health of the batteries. Um, I got a Fluke 325 here that has a min-max feature on it. Um, so we'll turn it on here. It's on AC right now. Turn it to DC. Get the min max feature rolling and so now what this is going to do is while i'm cranking the motor over i want to see what the minimum amount uh it drops down to so if it's below 10 volts um need to replace the batteries um this past winter i did uh, swap the batteries from this one to over here um uh this one here uh, I believe is the one that takes a little bit more um, juice uh, to run to start the uh, rig up. So I did have, I did buy this a few years ago and tested the old batteries that I had that I had in it, and it says right here to press the load switch ma a maximum of ten seconds. Um, read the meter with the load on anyways i did that and it read just fine and um i pulled my feather light trailer over to my sister's house um and we took care of some activities and uh went to start the truck and the batteries were dead so i didn't have any kind of a short or i didn't leave anything on um just weak batteries so I don't have any confidence with this. Um, my cousin, Mike, has been a top-level mechanic uh, most of his life, and uh, he told me this trick about the, uh, taught me this trick about the fluke meter. He has a fluke 87 that he uses for it, but the uh, this one will work just fine as well. So let's do the check, check here. Okay, we'll see what that minimum voltage was on this side. It dropped down to 10.3. Okay, I'm going to pause the video and hook it up to the other battery. It should be similar. Okay, we're on 12.8 volts. It's set to minimum again. We'll go see what we get for voltage drop here. Wow, 10.9. Okay, I'm going to have my cousin Mike watch this video and uh, stay tuned down in the comments below and see what he has to say about it. Um, hey, thanks for watching. All right, have a great day.